My dear friend, I ask you to take a few moments and pray with me. And at the same time, you're praying with others. We're going to pray together a special coronavirus prayer. It says in Isaiah 58 verse 9, Then you shall call, and the Lord will answer. You shall cry, and God will say, Here I am. Dear God, we know that you can turn the tide. And we know that our readers number a million strong. And the strength and the power and the effectiveness of united prayer can spiritually turn the tide in national and international affairs. Nothing opposed to God's good can last, and this will not last. Prayer can cause an outbreak of God-given health and accelerated recovery. As we say this prayer together, there is a listening audience of a trillion cells in each of our bodies, awaiting their direction. We pray that this God-empowered prayer can promote an upturn in comfort and in confidence. And we know that, God, you are the never-failing, all-providing source of health for all people everywhere. God is the creator that creates in a miraculous nine months' time, life. And God, you are also the recreator of life and full recovery under the divine blueprint of perfection. We pray that God's blueprint is made manifest in each of us right now. We pray that God the Creator creates atmospheres of perfection and complete sanitation. We pray that we are protected by God, surrounded by the Divine Presence at all times, in crowded places and in our alone places. We pray that we are infilled from the top of our heads to the bottom of our feet to the ends of our fingers with the regeneration of God that strengthens every cell and causes ongoing fortification of our complete immune system. We now put on the full armor of God. And we pray that God will guide us away from harm. And we pray that we do not inadvertently do harm to others. We pray, dear God, that you will remind us to vigorously wash our hands and will keep us from the habit of touching our own face. We will learn that we can mentally love and not need to shake hands or touch, at least temporarily, as this virus goes away forever. Thank you, God. Thank you that you will protect our dear caregivers, our wonderful doctors, our nurses, and also, God, we pray that you will guide the governments with exact precision on the best testing and medicines towards permanent healing. We pray that every scientist mind is infilled with the direct guidance of your mind, God. And we pray that divine ideas rule every day. We pray for those that have the virus that they experience immediate divine intervention help of you, God, to lessen its effects and quicken their permanent recovery. 
and we pray also for additional help for those affected, that they are helped financially with your unexpected supply and prosperity to take away any concern that they may have as they heal. With God's help, we know, God, this virus will pass and will soon be a distant memory as complete vitality and energy is experienced again. May you help God to remove our individual fears. God, give us the confidence to live our lives that you have so generously given to us. God's pattern of perfection in us is now expressed as a recreation of health and wholeness in body. We thank you, God, for restored health, for vital economy in our world. This challenge, we know, is touched by you, and God, health and vitality is brought into perfect manifestation beginning right now. We pray this in total belief in Jesus Christ's name. Amen.